We're here today to meet with Megan Mullen, senior from the softball team. Let's see what she's up to. I'm Megan Mullen. I'm a senior at UMD here, marketing major. I'm a pitcher and an outfielder, and I'm from Hermantown, Minnesota. All right, so it's your senior year, and unfortunately you have an elbow injury, mm -hmm. and you had surgery a couple months ago. Can you tell us about what happened? Um, so I went into the doctor. Um, I couldn't really throw, couldn't really pitch, so um, went into the doctor, took some x-rays, then they did an MRI because I couldn't really find anything on the x-rays. And what they found was kind of like a callus forming on my bone, like a bone spur. I'm not very good at medical <laughs> terminology, so I don't really know. Um, so they just had to go in and shave it down. Um, and then they didn't really know any recovery time, so that kind of worried me a little bit. But I've just been doing rehab and trying to get back into the swing things. So you haven't been pitching. You've been hitting, though, right? Mm -hmm. Do you know when you can start pitching yet? Well, I've been pitching. Um, it's just more of a fact of getting into some games. I feel like my arm's 100%. Uh, it's just, you know, getting those innings in against, mm -hmm. against our opponents. Mm -hmm. And it's your senior year, that has to be a bummer. How has that affected your game and everything? It's it's just something that you have to adjust to. I mean, there's really nothing that you can do, nothing I can do, other than just try and, try and work my hardest to um, get back into pitching, um, being confident with all my pitches. And well, hopefully we see you out there pitching soon. Being one of only two seniors, you're one of the only people who's actually played a game on campus, and you're just back last week. How was that? It was, it was so exciting just to be in front of our own crowd, um, our own fans. Just nice to have our own like family and everything be here on campus. We can sleep in our own beds, you know, eat our own meals. <laughs> yeah. So that was really nice. That has to be. Um, how does it feel playing on the football field? Because this isn't exactly the setting you'd see a softball game happen in, <laughs> but it's more of a reoccurring um, thing lately. Um, I guess it's... It's just playing on turf. We The only thing that we have to adjust to is the wind. Just because we've played so many games um, in domes and stuff, it's not really not really a big change for us. Well, that's good. Yeah. So you have to face a lot of obstacles being in Duluth and playing a spring sport. What's that like? How does that affect the team? It's something that we really can't control, so we just kind of have to deal with it as it comes. Uh, our coach always asks us, you know, do, do the things that we can control, and make the best of every situation that we have, so that's just what we're trying to do. There's a lot of teams that, do you think they struggle in this atmosphere or don't like coming to play here? I would say, yeah, just because they know it's cold up here, but hopefully um, they won't back out on us. Yeah, <laughs> maybe they anticipated a little too much. Yeah. yeah. So you're coming to, the, well, you're getting into your senior year. How does it feel with your last season? It's, it's tough to realize kind of that it's ending and that there really isn't anything after this for softball, um, but it, it, it's been a good four years here and I wouldn't, I wouldn't change it for a thing. Do you have any specific words you'd like to say to your teammates? Make the most of it because it goes by so fast. Like I just remember being a freshman with the girls that I am still good friends with and they came back this past weekend and it, it's, just, it's just fun to have this Bulldog family. Definitely. And do you have any plans for after graduation? Not yet. Um, still looking. I still have a few classes left, so I have a little bit of time. Yeah. Do you think you'll ever take softball into your future? Maybe be a coach or? I would like to. Um, I've kind of been looking into maybe doing like some pitching lessons, um, but not really any further information. Yeah. I've looked into. So. Okay. Memories <laughs> being a bulldog. I would say that just all the bus rides that we have. All the hotel rooms that we stay in, we always always find a way to have fun um, when we're on the road. So even though you're on the road a lot, you find a way to enjoy it. Yeah, That's we have it. to. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Make the best of it. Yeah.